Well, it's the moment so many people have been waiting for. Donald Trump is suing Hillary Clinton and her allies over falsely linking him to Russia. Trump filed the lawsuit in a federal court in Florida where he states Hillary Clinton and her cohorts orchestrated an unthinkable plot against the former president. Included in the lawsuit is Hillary Clinton, the Hillary for America, the Democratic National Committee, former FBI Director James Comey and many others. The 108-page document details the damages and demands for a trial by jury. It states, in the run-up to the 2016 presidential election, Hillary Clinton and her cohorts orchestrated an unthinkable plot, one that shocks the conscience and is an affront for this nation's democracy. Acting in concert, the defendants maliciously conspired to weave a false narrative that their Republican opponent, Donald J. Trump, was colluding with a hostile foreign sovereignty. The actions taken in furtherance of their scheme falsifying evidence, deceiving law enforcement and exploiting access to highly sensitive data sources are so outrageous, subversive and incendiary that even the events of Watergate pale in comparison. It continues, under the guise of opposition research, data analytics and other political stratagems, the defendants nefariously sought to sway the public's trust. They worked together with a single self-serving purpose to vilify Donald J. Trump Indeed, their far-reaching conspiracy was designed to cripple Trump's bid for presidency by fabricating a scandal that would be used to trigger an unfounded federal investigation and ignite a media frenzy. The scheme was conceived, coordinated and carried out by top-level officials at the Clinton campaign and the DNC, including the candidate herself, who attempted to shield her involvement behind a wall of third parties. Demands claim Donald Trump has sustained significant injuries and damages, including expenses in the form of defence costs, legal fees and related expenses incurred in connection with his efforts to defend against the defendant's notorious actions, false accusation and overall fraudulent scheme to discredit and delegitimise him. He has asked for no less than $24 million in damages and is seeking a trial with a jury. Last month, a poll carried out found two-thirds, or 66%, of Democrats believe Hillary Clinton should be investigated for her involvement in the Russiagate scandal. The poll comes as special counsel John Durham alleged that Hillary Clinton's campaign paid a tech firm to infiltrate servers at the Trump Tower and the White House. It was done with the aim to link the former president with Russia. The Durham investigation has been operating for a few years with the intention to examine the origins of the now discredited Russia collusion investigation. Mr Durham filed the motion that pertained to a possible conflict of interest related to the representation of former Clinton campaign lawyer Michael Sussman, who was also being named in Trump's lawsuit. Mr Sussman allegedly told the FBI he was not working on behalf of Ms Clinton when he presented documents that he claimed linked the Trump organisation to a Kremlin-tied bank, a claim of which he made just two months before the 2016 election and he has now been charged with making a false statement to a federal agent. Trump's lawyers mentioned Michael Sussman in the lawsuit multiple times. It reads, On a separate front, Perkins Coie partner Michael Sussman headed a campaign to develop misleading evidence of a bogus back-channel connection between email servers at Trump Tower and a Russian-owned bank. The filing of the Durham investigation alleges Mr Sussman had assembled these anti-Trump allegations on behalf of at least two clients, including the Clinton campaign. Mr Durham alleged Mr Sussman billed the Clinton campaign repeatedly for his work linking the Trump campaign to a bank with Russian connections. This was happening while the Clinton camp continued to push the narrative that Donald Trump was colluding with Russia to influence the outcome of the election. Trump has long maintained the Clinton camp spied on him during the 2016 election and while he was in office serving as the president. Last month, the former president responded to the updates from the Durham investigation with a statement that read... What Hillary Clinton and the radical left Democrats did with respect to spying on a president of the United States, even while in office, is a far bigger crime than Watergate. As news broke over Trump's decision to file the lawsuit, his supporters responded on social media. One person wrote, This is a battle for all Americans who are defamed by the radical left. Trump is fighting for truth. Another said that President Donald J. Trump is suing Hillary Rodham Clinton over fake Russia conspiracies. Next, she needs to be locked up. Someone else wrote, Trump suing Clinton is the best news I've heard in a long time. Finally, Donald J. Trump is suing Hillary Clinton and her Democratic Party and everybody involved in Russiagate. It's about damn time. You can't make this up.
you literally cannot make a story like this up. And Sean, you have been calling it out from the beginning. You are right. And President Trump is just not going to take it anymore. If you are going to make up lies, if you are going to try and take him down, he's going to fight you back. And that is what this is. This is the beginning of all that.